Welcome back to Pacific Beach Street. Hey, do you guys know anything about a buffalo cheese? They have buffaloes in Samoa. It goes like this. Lua pati! Lua pati! Salut al fa! Buffalo! Ooh. Buffalo mozzarella! It's Italiano cheese, you fops! <laughs> Tanga! You've heard of Bob Marley's Buffalo Soldier and probably tried tasty buffalo wings, but have you ever heard of buffalo cheese? We're here today in Clevedon to meet New Zealand's only buffalo cheese maker and to find out what makes their cheese an award-winning cheese. Cheese! Everybody, meet Helen, one of the team at the Clevedon Buffalo Company. How's it going, Helen? Good, Mike, yeah. Now, this who have we got here? Alice and Bosco. And these are baby buffalo? Yes, they're babies. They're about four months old. And the question that every New Zealander is thinking of at the moment, why buffalo cheese? We loved buffalo mozzarella. We'd had it in Italy and we thought, well, why not? Well, I'm here today to see some buffalo cheese making. Can you take me out to see the real big ones? Certainly. My pleasure. All right, let's go. <laughs> We're out here with the buffalo. Now, they're absolutely magnificent. How big did you say they could get to? I think the girl's about 800 kilos. And no other people in New Zealand make buffalo cheese? We're the first people to make it and shortly the first people to be selling it, yeah. Once you get the milk from the buffalo, where does it go to to make the cheese? It goes to our factory where we process it. Right, well, let's head over to the factory. Everybody meet Richard, buffalo cheesemaker extraordinaire. Richard, so what type of cheese do you actually make? Uh, we make a buffalo mozzarella. It's not so much a pizza cheese. It's a cheese that you have on a salad, mainly what they'd call like a crazy salad with tomatoes and olive oil and basil. This is where all the cheese is made. Richard, can you walk me through what the process actually is? Certainly. What basically happens, we bring the milk in from the other side where we've just pasteurised it. It comes in via this pipe and we put it into this tank here. Once we've done what we have to do in here, we then tip this thing up and we put the curd on this draining table over here. Yep. Stays there for roughly half an hour and then we cut it up, add boiling water to it, and we stretch it in this bowl here. And then it's ready to go? Uh, what we do, we pinch it off by hand and place it into these cooling tubs. That's the mozzarella cooling down. Where can I try some of your finished product? At home. You go on home and have some with Helen. Sweet. Well, thank you very much, Richard, showing us how to make buffalo cheese. Let's go find Helen and try some of this amazing stuff. So this is it, the final product. Helen, can you tell me how you've prepared this? This is a um, caprese salad, they call it. Tomato, mozzarella, basil, uh, olive oil, a uh, bit of salt and pepper. Very easy. Can we try it? Please do. All right. Mmm. It's a mouthful. It's good. And it's different. Mm -hmm. And it's yeeful. <laughs> Thank you very much, Helen, and to Richard as well for showing us how to make this amazing cheese. If you guys want to know more, check out the website below. The best of luck for the future. Okay. And we'll see you guys later on at the house. Ciao. They dominated the New Zealand music scene, then made the move to Melbourne. But you know the saying, home is where the heart is. Well, they're back where it all started. So why are they here and will they stay? Let's ask for a patrol. Missed you guys, <laughs> everybody. This is Fur Patrol. Welcome home. Oh my gosh, give a hug. Okay, let's go through. Come. Fur Patrol, welcome to the Beach Street Fale. Thank you for having us. And welcome back home. Welcome to New Zealand. How does it feel to be back? Um, feels bloody good. Yeah. Did you? We've missed you guys. Did you guys miss us? Yes. Unbelievably. Oh. Mm. So please help yourself to the welcome home fruit platter and got some juice here. Oh. Before we start, let's have a little cheers. Chin chin. Cheers to Julie and Angie of Fur Patrol. Now, what brings you back here to Aotearoa? We come back to play some shows um, and to sort of talk, talk up our new album, which is coming out on September 22nd. Yes, the local kid. That's correct. And um, yeah, basically come back and get a good dose of New Zealand again. Why did you guys decide to move over to Melbourne? We decided that we wanted to go and try and play to a whole lot more people. What was the reaction from the Aussie music scene? Uh, it didn't really pan out the way that we thought that it might do. You know, we're not mega stars over there or anything like that. Uh, not that we sort of 
went intending for that to <laughs> happen. You always go hoping that something yeah, like that yeah. might happen. But we've sort of taken a little hiatus from um, playing and everything. But you know, you're still going strong. What's what's the secret? What's the perpetual secret? You know, it's never occurred to us to stop. <laughs> <laughs> Ultimately, when we sort of get together and play music, we really enjoy it, and there's a certain yeah, yeah. a certain joy that comes from that that you can't really get from anything else. Where does the name Fruit Patrol come from? Um, How did you guys get it? Well, the thing is, this is this is something that we've always done is never tell people. So How we, you came we, up with the name? Yeah, because the, the oh, reality. Oh come on, you got to tell me. No, no, we like to leave it up to people's imaginations because the reality is nowhere near as exciting as what you're going to come up with. Do you write songs for? For, to make number one hits, or do you just write mm -mm. it for the people? No, just, oh, to, to be really honest, I mean, I just write for myself. Yeah. Because, I don't know, I get these ideas in my head and they need to, they need to come out. Well, before you guys head back to Melbourne, and before you head back to Wally, Andrew, would love it if you guys could play us a song here at the house. Sweet Sound as, cool? no worries. But before that, oh. can I just hear Lydia one more time, just Bring back those high school memories. <laughs> the guitar's right here. I'll play it. Yeah. You sing it. OK, I'll, okay. I'll give it a go. Okay. But if I start to, you know, go off track, okay. you join in with me, OK? Just the chorus, yeah? Yeah. Come, baby. Mom, baby. Don't you want me High five, girl. Oh, that's bringing it, taking it back to the old school. Yeah. Fair Patrol, baby. Thanks for hanging with us today. Keep checking out our website. Thank you to all our guests for being part of the show this week. Have a safe week, people. Now we're going to leave you with Fair Patrol. <laughs> This program was made with funding from New Zealand on air.